Guys, the sun's not out and it's 80 degrees. It's back to Florida weather. Mm -hmm. But I had to go get an oil change in the car. That's what it was, right? an oil change. An oil change and I don't know what happened. I think I stayed at work a little bit later than usual. Yeah, it's a late start. It's, it's so almost it's late. time for Happily Ever After already. Well, that's because of park operations. It's, a, it's This whole week, the parks are closing early. Yeah. But. Peter's going on a run. And we are at our favorite resort, Wilderness Lodge. We, Peter's never tried, so we've never tried this running path. Peter has never tried this running path before. So I'm gonna run, it says it's 2.5 miles, but I don't know if it's round trip one way from Wilderness Lodge to Fort Wilderness. I believe you're not supposed to do this at night, but I didn't see anything that's something you're not supposed to. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna give it a try. Let it know, let you guys know how it goes. Sarah's gonna hang out, I'm read gonna a read, book. I'm gonna watch Happily Ever After from Bay Lake. When I hear it, I'll be like, sweating. Like, <laughs> I wish I was with Sarah just sitting there watching Happily Ever After. It'll be worth it. I'm back. I tried getting footage on the phone, but I think it was like steamy for my sweaty hands, so I don't know if Sarah will be able to edit it. But look at this. There you go. That's my path. Six miles. Six miles? So I started in my self focus. On. Yeah. I started right here. Uh huh. Right where the boat rental is for Fort Wilderness Lodge. Ran past the bus stop. There's a trail. Do not do this run at night. I'll never do it again. It was a mistake that I did that part of it because it's three quarters of a mile from here to Fort Wilderness. Mm -hmm. Not a single bit of light. No. We're on a paved path. Peter. But it was dark. And I almost like took a bus, a bus or a boat back. But I didn't. I just ran. But Fort Wilderness at night is still be cautious because there's like, you can't really see the creeks, but. <laughs> but it's a good run. I did. A, I didn't scare a deer. A family by me that was like playing by the road scared a deer and it like ran like maybe towards 15, you. No, like it ran like 15 feet across from me. Mm -hmm. I tried getting on Instagram, so if you saw that ridiculous <laughs> Insta story, I didn't get it. But it was cool. I saw Bambi. Like it was like not. It was like a teenager. Mm -hmm. But I ran from here all the way to the furthest corner of. The, four, the front of Fort Wilderness. Oh my gosh. And that's right by about four seasons and I tried getting some of the fireworks because that was going uh -huh. off and then I ran back. So it's like three miles from here to the corner, the furthest corner of Fort Wilderness. One of our viewers, Karen, is staying at Fort Wilderness right now and she's messaging me. Um, and she, if you and heard, she said she said that she does it like a bike ride. We should we should we should do rides. that. I was blessed. I know we can. I had a fuel ride because my phone was dying. So I actually I thought it was like a defense mechanism for the animals not to come near me. I was blessed with British Showman on my phone. <laughs> so Karen, if you heard me, if you heard British Showman playing from the darkness, eight, seven thirty to eight forty-five, <laughs> that was me. Mm -hmm. I tried playing it loud enough. But not loud too loud. But I'm gonna change because I'm stopping one. And then can we finish this movie? No, I'm gonna finish for some fun before we go relax inside the best resort. We say it every time, and we're gonna say it every time. This is our favorite resort, and it's the favorite. honest, honest truth that it's our favorite. Mm -hmm. Fireplace. I wanted huh. to go on a shorter run today. Well, no, I wanted to go on at least four miles. But something got in me. I think it was because I could hear. Um, well, first of all, I was scared in the first and last mile. I was scared in that running path. I should not have gone there. So please do not do this run, the trail at night. Um, but in the middle of it, I was just like adrenaline from like, I don't, I've only run in Disney twice. 
something like that. Something like that, but never here. And then happily ever after was going on, and I could hear it, and I stopped to watch oh, part of it. Is I saw a Bambi, a security guard like thought I was being suspicious. <laughs> and I'm like, no, I'm just watching fireworks. And he's like, okay, cool. <laughs> I was also covered in sweat, so I was like, I don't know how suspicious I could be if I'm like drenched in sweat, blasting greatest showman in a parking lot watching fireworks. It's pretty intimidating. In like the furthest corner of Fort Wilderness. And I wasn't even by campsites. I was like in an open near an open field closer to four seasons. We're gonna go home now. I think we are going to give Eve a bath, do some dishes. Yeah, we should. We really need to, but I'm tired and I'm hungry, and all I want is a McPick 2 from McDonald's. You can share it. Eve was super cute when we got back. Mm -hmm. but, she was like stern. We wanted to show you something we got in the mail today because we, Sarah and I like joined a giveaway and we actually won it. Ooh. Letters and characters, which is Yoho Disney? Yes, Yoho Disney. Um, but it's the sister company to Lillian and Co. Mm -hmm. And so it's letters and characters. And so they sent us one of their cool, the, the, what they do is they send like letter boards. And look at that. <laughs> well, now, do not think they sent it with that. Yeah, no. <laughs> we did that when I got here. This it's good is how to be the home. letters come. That's how the letters come. You get the cool bag. Mm -hmm. I have no idea the price. Um, but we appreciate I don't either, but we'll put the link below for the website. They come in pink, blue, yellow, red, or black, but we just went classic. Um, so yeah, we have that on there now, but we'll probably change it up. They'll put some cool pins in there too. Oh yeah, and I think we've already explained like that's where that quote comes from is Sarah's dad. Yeah, like literally well, we Well, from would, Disney. Right, we from would dad, from Disney. be like checking in to Old Key West and he'd like tell the guy it's good to be home. Then he's getting our dinner and he's cashing out. It's good to be home. Like literally would say it to every single cast member. And like, of course, it became a joke. He was sleeping on the ground. But he was laying there, like. But literally, like, we would be like, "Dad, don't say it anymore to anyone." <laughs> but so that's why we say it, and it's a nice place. We can we can put all different kinds of quotes under there. Yeah, we can swap it up, like the holidays, like Merry Christmas one. I'm gonna show this too. This is what I do when I do the dishes. Mm -hmm. Is I set this up like it's our Gorilla Pod, like you're supposed to use as like a vlogging stick or just a tripod and I put my cell phone on there and I play YouTube videos on it. This is just true. A little, just a little fun fact. Were you doing anything else tonight? We were going to give you a bath but it's midnight and we'll probably just do that tomorrow. Is anybody else pumped for the Olympics? Because we, we are. are. We don't know what to do. That's what we do. We have to research to see if Disney is doing anything for the Olympics because they, a lot of the lounges were showing the Super Bowl so I want to see if there's anywhere our friend Jill said that City Walk might be showing at like um, the NBC restaurant, I NBC think it's called. Sports Grill or something. Might be showing it on the big TV outside. So we got to figure it out, but we want to do something. Us, Kristen and Chelsea too. We want to do something for the Olympics because we are all about the Olympics. Yes. Still mad that it didn't go to Chicago. But. In 2016. But with that, it's good to be, good home. To be home. We know what our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.